Hello, I'm Michael, and today I will be reviewing the new firmware upgrade for the YPT-10. I reviewed an earlier upgrade before, but Samsung keeps adding amazing new firmware functions for the MP3 player. I am looking forward to seeing the new firmware for the newly released P2, T10, and S5. Today, I will be reviewing the new firmware for the YPT-10. This firmware has taken into account many users' opinions. Shall I check which functions have been added? For your information, you can automatically update the firmware by downloading it from support download center at samsung.com or by using SMS. Three interesting games have been added with this upgrade. They are Bomb Bomb, Bubble Smile, and Chicken Runaway. Shall I try to play Bomb Bomb first? It's like a mix between Tetris and Hexa. Now I will play the game Bubble Smile. You have to rotate to match the colors. Whew, I think I'll have to use my brain. And finally, this is the game Chicken Runaway. With this game, you have to avoid the balls and you have to save the chicks. What do you think? Don't you think it's a good way to spend time? The biggest change in this firmware is that it provides GUI that has 10 new themes. The themes are applied to each file and you can easily change by copying the RSC file to the T10. I already put on the theme Wonderful Tonight. How is it? Isn't it brilliant? I will change this into another theme. Let me copy the theme Colorful Dream. After turning it on, the firmware is updated. The updating is over, so we'll turn this on again. It's a fairy tale style. It's very cute. I'm very curious about the other themes as well. Shall I try? When I used the T10, the fact that I couldn't delete files was the most inconvenient thing. 
If you have to record something, but there is no space left, then you may have difficulties. But with this firmware upgrade, this problem has been solved. Select a file from File Browser, pressing the Delete button on the menu, and then it will delete the file. In the case of displaying text with the T10, it was a little awkward because there wasn't a horizontal mode. Now, the ability to display horizontally has been added. After opening a text file, press the menu button. Select view type menu that has been newly created and change it into horizontal. You can feel that it is a much more convenient way to see the files. With this firmware upgrade of the T10, AAC codec is supported. It supports AAC LC, AAC Plus, and enhanced AAC Plus. So now we can hear the music with better sound quality and a smaller size. When you watch a movie, you can bookmark it. Every movie can be bookmarked separately, and you can bookmark a maximum of 100 movies. Wow, 100? Shall I try? In relation to the firmware upgrade of the T10, many various functions were impressive, but the functions that reflected the user's opinions seem to be the most amazing. If you have any ideas, why don't you tell Samsung to put them in a new firmware upgrade? I'm Michael. Thank you.